Kajuani Johanine, Johanine, Kajuani Johanine. Nuodio liuazen akuzaslonot galas. Aze di duadu nenelo dinat dunkwa ne cultural restoration program tkali hoanatu chiknahoda lodiote. Nuahuni zalade, ladiantos dano kakwa ue ne oni ne duadolata dano duadalista yana de galat negas ahun deweas Gina Hodile, Hunt Quadago, Neonogia. Sego so Gwego, Gasnegoheni Jungiats, Dano at Keliwanata, Ne Akosasne de Oyax. Sego, Sego, No de Azayat. Kahawi Zolo. What did you do today? Today we facilitated for the hunters and trappers at Ganehio Jungiat Dunhege, this facility that you see here. And basically, I'm with the horticulture department, and also I work alongside with Yedinalat de Dinyas, who is the um, traditional food specialist. And what we're doing today to help the hunters and the trappers um, with the skinning of their anogia, cooking their anogia, we're introducing the vegetables for the dinner we're going to have with it. And so basically, we facilitated this place here at Gunny Hill um, to do just that. We work alongside the hunters, and we will be in the future um, to protect um, our corn, our white corn, um, by utilizing the hunters in their traps. So it keeps the population of those critters down um, from eating all our corn. So it's a good relationship we have. And we're very fortunate to have this facility down here at Gunny Hill, uh, the cannery, cannery part, to, to host um, this event and events that come up um, to process the meats, our traditional meats, our traditional foods that we eat. And um, they taught us how to take the glands out of the onogio, out of the muskrat, because the gland um, makes the meat a little bit bitter so they taught us um, being in traditional foods muskrat being a traditional food to take that out so our meat's going to taste really good at lunchtime today so that was our part yes yesterday and our part today is getting the vegetables ready um, to make the stew to make uh, the food we're going to eat at noon today <laughs> Sego, I'm the now. Yes. My involvement with this program, I got hired to the ACR program that just started last last year, I guess. And I was hired as a the master teacher for a trapper, trapper instructor. And I have four apprentices that I show. We started trapping October, October a couple weeks ago. That's this year. How to set the traps, uh, check the traps, catch the muskrats, uh, skinning them, put them on a stretcher, drying them as they look like here. Oh, for this product here. Three days, room temperature 65, 70 degrees. And show them how to clean it. We got some uh, cleaned, ready to be cooked. Long shirt, gonna stretch it out. Stretcher. You just slide it on here. Once you get done skinning it, you take the excess fat off. You scrape it. It takes about, well, I've been doing this for about well, 40 years, so it takes me like three minutes to skin a muskrat. It's two minutes. How far do you think the apprentices came? Uh, some caught on pretty quick. Others are still learning how to catch on and stuff. It takes a while. It's something, uh, 
takes a little while to practice. I do it all the time. Yeah, well. Yo. It's awesome learning a lot from the uh, Nama. Uh, I never knew how to do this. So skin a muskrat, skin a deer, but never a muskrat or a beaver. Would you say that you're pretty good at it now? Like. With practice, you yeah. you can do it yourself now. Yeah, you tell me pretty good. Yeah, one for sharing. Are you with? 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 Are you with?